procession of the Holy Blood takes place in the heart of the city of Bruges, located in Belgium. The historic city center of Bruges was recognized by UNESCO as a World Heritage Site in 2000. This unique historic setting is nowadays a vibrant city with its 120,000 inhabitants and numerous visitors. Every year, on Ascension Day in the beginning of May, the procession of the Holy Blood goes out on the main streets and squares of the city center of Bruges. The procession culminates around a relic, the blood of Christ. This blood, that according to a legend, was brought to Bruges in the 13th century, is kept in a special church in the heart of the city, the Holy Blood Basilica on the Berg Square. From the beginning of the 14th century, there are written traces of a Holy Blood procession going round the city walls. This was a collective protection rite involving guilds of master artisans and of archers, clergy and city officials. A unique mixture of historical scenes and biblical stories, religious and civil features would be characteristic for the procession for the next seven centuries. Before the Heer, we two clothes have, we deal with we not have. And we voedsel have, we do it self. And he, Heer Oders, it is not geoorloofd a vrouw van uw broer to have. Soldaten, neem die man gevangen. More than 1,700 citizens of all ages participate in the procession of the Holy Blood. The participants are a representative cross-section of the population of Bruges, with ages varying between a few months and 90 years old. Remarkable is the stability of this group. About 80% of the 1,700 costume participants of the parade participate every year. A significant portion hands down the membership and even specific roles in the procession from generation to generation. Dozens of local groups and communities take great pride in participating or sending a delegation. Without these 1,700 volunteers, there would be no procession. The costumed groups take part on horseback, on carts and on foot. The Noble Brotherhood of the Holy Blood organizes the procession. This corporation was founded in the 15th century to safeguard the relic of the Holy Blood, to further the veneration and to organize the procession. On ceremonial occasions, the members of the Brotherhood wear a black toga on which a pelican feeding her young with her own blood is embroidered. For centuries, the procession has had an important function for the identity of the city and its inhabitants. It was and still remains a unique occasion for encounters with people from outside the city, a day of official and unofficial meetings. The Burgomaster of Bruges and the provincial governor tend to welcome guests like ambassadors, diplomats and employees of international organizations. The Bishop of Bruges welcomes bishops, cardinals and other clergymen from all over the world. And the people of Bruges celebrate what's called Bruges' most beautiful day, participating in or simply enjoying the procession. In recent years, the procession of the Holy Blood has attracted 30 to 45,000 people. Next to people living in Belgium, spectators come from all over the world to participate. 
the increasingly large group of international spectators mainly come from France, the United Kingdom, the Netherlands, Spain, South America, North America, Japan and Russia. Although the dialogues in the procession are in Dutch, printed information is made available in Dutch, French, English and German. <laughs>